Meet Jess and Michelle. Their mother-daughter relationship is full of surprises. This morning I woke up and she had pink hair and I was like, what are you doing? She came down from the bathroom. I'm like, what have you done? I found it. Yeah, I haven't seen it for three years. It. Great, of all days. <laughs> Are you feeling? I'm really excited. I've been oh, waiting yeah. my whole life to get my own dog because my mum's got staffies. Oh, have you? I mean, have you got? I've got two. Oh, uh, nice. One's from here. Oh, amazing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's like loyalty card stuff, that, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do we get another one free? <laughs> free? Well, not yet. I think it's after your fifth one. <laughs> I'm going to be a dog mum. <laughs> I'm going to be a nanny. I oh, know. Whichever oh. way around that is. Not very <laughs> nanny. <laughs> Do you have an idea about what sort of dog you're looking for? So, I'm kind of looking the younger the better. The younger the better? Yeah, I think so. It's for me. Dog's for me. I'd quite like a bull breed type of dog, but I do quite like Rottweilers as well. They're not the sort of breeds that people traditionally would come yeah. to rescue and choose. Yeah. I think it's like they've got a slight protective element to them as well, which I quite like. When Jess said, I need a dog, said, we're continuing the family tradition, <laughs> rescue. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jesse's father and I are split up um, after quite a long relationship. Um, and I'd always wanted a dog. <laughs> Marched off down here, got myself a doggy. They don't care if you've got no makeup on, you're in your sloppy joes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think it would just be nice to have like a companion that I feel safe walking at any time of day, really. Cos I've just broken up with an ex. Um, after six years, uh, he left me. Oh, difficult. difficult. Yeah, it's very fresh, actually. Um, I'm mostly on my own, so I just think it's the right time to kind of yeah, get a, a dog. Yeah, I kind of need to fill that gap. A dog, you know, they're always there for you, no matter oh, what. Yeah. They are. Yeah. yeah. On your worst days and your best. I just need to, yeah. to go away and try and find that match for you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a whole bag of emotions, I am. Me, I feel like a bag of nails. What? So they want a staffy type, which Perfect. is brilliant. Yeah. Or Amazing. a rotty. She wants a dog that's going to be all over her. <laughs> I have got a perfect dog in mind for her. Who's that? Jax. My absolute favourite dog on site, no question. He is lovely. Um, I think anything that was too big would make her feel really anxious. That's a shame. Close, but not quite. <laughs> Staffy that we've got. Gloria. 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 Who's also called G, isn't she? <laughs> <laughs> Get her a blingy oh. collar. Oh, she came in as a stray. Her three favourite things, attention, cuddles and playing with people. Oh, that's a good start. She sounds amazing. I'd quite like her. Hands off. <laughs> <laughs> they could just build such a lovely life together, couldn't they? We did find one. OK. Mm. Little yeah. lady. Oh. So right. we're going to potentially have an all-female crew. Lovely. Like um, that. Girl and she's a little staffy. Oh, yes. yes. Okay. She's called Gloria, although her oh. foster calls her G. <laughs> little G. And she's young, too. <laughs> she's a year and a half. OK, oh, perfect. perfect. So we don't need to ask if you want to meet her. No, we don't. Love to. <laughs> you ready? Yeah, ready yeah. yeah. now. Thank, Thank you. you. Good luck. Hello. Wow. Hello, gorgeous. Hello, gorgeous girl. Gloria was brought in by a member of the public after a narrow escape with their car. Come on. Can we get it? Can we get it? <laughs> we have absolutely no idea about her past life. Oh, they're coming in for the shot. They're coming in for the shot, Gloria. Hopefully she hasn't, you know, come into any conflict with people. Come on. That's it. Oh, my, oh, she's so dainty. Do you want to come up properly? Do you want to come up a minute? Oh, she doesn't want to. Aubrey's, because of their gregarious, excitable nature, will probably go to people that are confident, fun-loving. Whoa. Thank you. She's going to want that fun, energetic person. But it may take some time to, to build that trust and that relationship. Little Gloria. It's kind of quite scary, in a sense. Yeah, I know. Because you really want it to work. I know. I met my partner and we were happy. We've got lovely friends. We've got good jobs. The dream house. 
We'd been there maybe nine months and things just started seeming off and I wasn't sure what it was. Oh, here we go. Right. We were meant to go see my dad for Father's Day and he disappeared, he just went out. So I was like, this is really strange. The next day, I sat down with him and he just said, I think we should break up. And he packed a bag and left at about 10 o'clock at night. And that was it. I was in this house that we just bought together on my own. Well, she doesn't like me. Of course she will. You know, you have those doubts, don't you? This was meant to be the person that I live with for the rest of my life. He hasn't given me a proper explanation. He's just walked away. I think it's always easier to move on if you have something to blame, if you like. That's what plays on her the most. I have to try not to cry. I can feel it already. I'm a soppy date. I am a soppy date. I've got to relax a bit. Sit there looking out a window. I know. I'm trying to look at other things. I wanted to take the pain away. Hence, I'm here helping. Can't look. Can't no. look. I can't. I can't take my eyes. Oh, yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> Ready now. Oh, dear me. Gloria the Staffy is on her way to charm Jess and her mum, Michelle. I mean, she's not for me, but. Well, the tummy's going round. Yeah, mine is. But, oh, is she there? I just want them to have that moment where she looks into her eyes. Mm. She's just like, take me home. Someone's coming, someone's coming. God, she's beautiful. Oh, yeah. She is the life of the party. Oh. She loves people. What are you doing? Oh, bless her. She wants to come out. <laughs> There's a clever girl. Who's a clever girl? Yes. Come on, then. Ready? Steady. Fetch. Oh! <gasps> right, ready? Oh, Mum's kind of taking the lead, because I guess she probably knows how to get a dog to interact positively with her. What's this? What's this? She's got a wafty tail. She likes you, well, she likes me. Wafty, 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 wafty. Wah, 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 Talk to her. Get her interested. There's a good girl. What's this? I wouldn't be surprised if she's feeling, am I good enough for this dog? I was just going to say that, it's that fear of not being enough. How are you getting on? I think I was just waiting for that instant... That instant connection. Yeah. I think it's always difficult because yeah. the dog will naturally go to often the person that's the most confident. Yeah. In the nicest possible oh, way. Right. Are you happy to let them just have a little bit of time most together? Definitely. And we can see how you're yeah. feeling. I'll grab my bag. See you yeah. later. <laughs> yeah. Thank I'll you. Give you a few minutes, yeah, okay? Yeah, thank you. Gee. Come here. Gigi. Gigi. I know you want to leave, but you're stuck in here with me. Hey, come here. You've you've got this empty feeling where something once was. Gloria, come on. Come here. Come here. <laughs> you want to play with this or not? He's still got his belongings in the house. It's like a shadow. He's like a shadow of a person that was there. Come on. Step away from the door. Do you want a water? Do you want some drink? Do you want a drink? Yeah? That's the trick, in it? That's the trick. No! Oh. <laughs> you cute. I love it when stuffies do that, when they put their head over your shoulder. Mm. Then you know that you've won their heart. We had that moment. I was trying not to cry. 
It's because she kind of felt me. She was there. It was like a bit of acceptance from her. <laughs> hey, you're not better. Get out me now. <laughs> hey? Could just imagine her in my house, really, just plonking herself on the sofa next to me. Jess and little G. Sitting in the tree. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's better. <laughs> Initially, I had doubts and I kept talking to my family about it. I don't know if she's right, and everyone just said she's perfect for you. Gigi! Hello! Hello! I know, I know. Please don't lick my face. I got makeup on today. <laughs> she gets up to all sorts. She's nibbled through some cables, she's eaten some slippers. Um, she definitely owns the place. Hmm? You wanna play? Oh, you do. Gigi sleeps in my bed with me. That wasn't the initial plan, but she's wormed her way up there very, very quickly. <laughs> Gigi! There you go. Good girl. She's definitely helped me throughout the breakup. Um, hey, haven't you? Help me. <laughs> I'm definitely a lot more confident than I was before. And now, all of a sudden, I'm dating again. It's been really fun. Um, yeah, I do it quite a lot. <laughs>